Hello everyone, my name is Richard Knight and I'm president of the American Association of Kidney Patients. It is my distinct honor today to present the 2021 Medal of Excellence Award in Transplant Professional category to Dr. Emily Bloomberg. Dr. Bloomberg is a transplant infectious disease specialist and the director of the Transplant Infectious Disease Program and the Infectious Disease Fellowship at the University of Pennsylvania. She is currently a professor of medicine at the University of Pennsylvania and is a fellow of the American Society of Transplantation, the Infectious Disease Society of America, and the American College of Physicians. Dr. Bloomberg's academic interests are focused on infectious disease complications in transplant recipients and candidates. She is especially interested in donor-derived infectious and viral infections, including HIV, HCV, CMV, and now COVID-19. She has coordinated the COVID-19 activities of the AST and has become one of the leaders of the Multi-Society Committee for the International COVID Webinar Series. She is former chair of the UNOS Disease Transmission and Advisory Committee and former member of the UNOS MPSC, the HHS Advisory Committee on Blood and Tissue Safety and Availability, and of the Gift of Life Philadelphia Medical Advisory Board. She is the past chair of the Infectious Disease Society of America, Training Program Directors Committee, and the IDSA Medical Scholars Program. When asked what patients have taught her, Dr. Bloomberg responded as follows. Caring for the patient is the most rewarding part of my career as a transplant physician. I am constantly inspired by my patients and feel that it is an incredible privilege to be welcomed into their lives and entrusted with their care. Understanding the unique conditions that define each individual's experience has taught me to be more open-minded and appreciative of the diversity of the human experience. After 30 years in practice, it has been especially thrilling to witness how transplantation has allowed so many individuals to fulfill their dreams and enjoy their time with their family and friends. I am honored to be part of their journey. Dr. Bloomberg? I want to thank Richard Knight and the AAKP for this incredible honor. Working with patients has always been the most important part of my career and the aspect that has really motivated me to continually strive to always do my best. So I'm especially grateful to be recognized by this groundbreaking and forward-thinking patient-driven and focused organization. I think that we all need to recognize how challenging this past year has been for all of us. For those working in transplant, We've had unique challenges as we try to safely continue offering transplantation during the pandemic. For infectious diseases doctors like myself, it's been especially important to look critically at all of our practices on a daily basis as the information we receive continues to evolve at an unprecedented pace. Personally, I prioritize making sure we both inform not just our medical colleagues, but our patient community as well as do my best to keep everyone safe during such a frightening time. I've appreciated the opportunity that I've had to work with AAKP to provide current information to the community, as I know that sharing of accurate and up-to-date information is an important part of the AAKP mission. Like everything in transplantation, the work that I've done would not have been possible without the support of incredible colleagues at Penn Transplant Institute and in the Penn Infectious Diseases Division, as well as my colleagues and the staff at the American Society of Transplantation. We've definitely worked as a team to meet the challenges of the pandemic. I'm also very lucky to have the support of my family, my husband, John, and daughters, Alyssa and Gabrielle, and son-in-law, James. Many thanks again to Richard Knight and the rest of the AAKP board and staff for this most meaningful award. I look forward to continued collaborations in the future, hopefully that is one, one that is soon COVID-free.